Okay, so this is Adenum's Ghost Chip, a Ghost Lapel Ale. It's four point five percent. I really love the artwork on this. The you know the old ship. I guess these are seagulls. Um, kind of looks like night time. That kind of looks like moonlight. Yeah, really nice artwork. Um, I think this only used to come out at Halloween, but I'm pretty sure that um, this past year, this whole past year, I've seen it in the shops. Like at summertime, I've seen it. Um, in the shops and stuff and I've I've had this once before it was a couple of years ago and I did like it can't remember exactly what it's like though um, just seeing if it, if it says anything interesting on the back <laughs> not really yeah it doesn't usually I, I'm pretty, pretty sure that usually on cans of ale it kind of gives a description on the can of what the the ale is like, but it it doesn't seem to on this one. Just says you know, just says the ingredients, malted barley, <clears throat> stuff like that. Um, made in Suffolk, England. Okay, so let's crack this open. Yeah, I really like this glass. Um, saw it in Tesco a few weeks ago. Um, there's like a, um, a clearance shelf with loads of these glasses on it, and they were all selling for like 50p each, which is a total bargain. So I thought I'll definitely get one for 50p because I do like the <clears throat> I do like the way they look, like how they're kind of like like jars, but uh, a glass at the same time with a handle on it. So I'm guessing maybe these weren't selling that well because. Um, Probably a month before that, I was seeing them selling for just a quid each. Um, not really sure why I didn't pick one up then, but yeah. Um, let's uh, let's see what this smells like. Wow, that is really really nice. It smells like ale, but it's like there's a lot more there's there's a lot more to it. Um, kind of smells like maybe there's honey in it or something. I don't know, but it's got a really nice aroma. Let's see what it tastes like. It's hard, it's hard to describe the taste. Um, seems like there's a little bit of citrus in there. Um, I think I think it basically tastes like a golden ale. That's what it makes me think of, anyway. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what to say about it, to be honest. Um, you know, it's got a really nice flavour, um, really nice aroma. Um, probably one of the nicest ales that I've had. I'd say, I'd say probably the nicest ale that I've ever had is um, Honey Ale. Um, this isn't quite as good as that, but it's still really good. It's still better than a lot of other ales that I've had. Um, I was saying it kind of smells like there's honey in it, but it doesn't, it doesn't taste like there's honey in it. But yeah, um... Um, I think I'll give this an 8 out of 10. It's um, really nice. And um, yeah, I think a four pack of this was under four pound. I think maybe it was something like three pound seventy five. So yeah, I'd, I'd definitely recommend it if you like ales. Um, give this a try. Thanks for watching.